In this activity, we will learn how to obtain crystals of copper sulfate from its solution. For this activity, we need a tripod stand, a pair of tongs, a kerosene burner, a glass rod, a spatula, copper sulfate powder, a watch glass, a matchbox, concentrated sulfuric acid, a china dish, water, funnel, beaker and filter paper. Let us first take some volume of water in china dish. Now light the kerosene burner. Be careful while lighting the burner. Quickly cover it with the stand and place the tripod stand on it. Now place the china dish and let the water get heated for some time. To this water add two spatulas of copper sulfate powder and stir it. As the copper sulfate powder is about to get dissolved, add one spatula more of copper sulfate. Keep on stirring the solution so that the copper sulfate powder gets mixed and completely dissolved in water. Once the copper sulfate gets dissolved and you obtain again a clear solution, add two spatulas of copper sulfate more to the solution. Keep on adding copper sulfate powder to the solution till the time you get a saturated solution. That means to the same volume of water when you add more amount of copper sulfate it does not get dissolved even when it is being heated. We can add some more amount of copper sulphate to the solution. Keep on stirring the solution till it forms a saturated solution which means no more of copper sulphate can be added to the solution. Now, Take a beaker, fix a funnel onto it and arrange the filter paper in a cone shape onto the funnel. Now take off the solution from the burner and filter it. Let the solution get filtered slowly. Leave the solution of copper sulphate undisturbed for some time. After some time, we will observe crystals of copper sulphate appearing at the bottom of the beaker. Let the solution dry properly and after that we can obtain clear crystals of copper sulphate. What do we conclude from this activity? We can use 
solution of metals to obtain their pure form as crystals. This process of obtaining pure crystals of metals from their aqueous solutions is known as crystallization. We can obtain crystals of copper from copper sulfate solution.